Hello, my name is Miss Johnson, and you're watching Everyday Titans. Is it break yet? What's up, Titans? It's Thursday, December 20th. I'm Liam Hardman, and you're watching Everyday Titan. I know you guys, a lot, a lot of you guys probably feel like me right now, but hang tight, break will be here before you know it. On another note, let's just get into some announcements. Attention all key clubbers, the last meeting of 2018 is today, December 20th, after school in the auditorium lecture hall. Come share some treats and find out about the last events of the year. It's time once again for the ACPS Annual Poetry Writing Contest. Submissions can be in any poetic form and no longer than a page. One winner will be chosen per grade level and published in Theogony. Send your creations to Miss Bridget Tomic at the email below or stop by Villa Number 6 to drop them off in person. Titan Robotics is having a fundraiser tonight, December 20th, from 6 to 8 p.m. at Holy Cow in Delray to help them prepare for their build season. Please tell the cashier you are with Titan Robotics when you pay. Why not help out? Are you interested in politics? Do you care about civic engagement? Do you think voting is important? If the answer to any of those questions is yes, then come to the Inspire US meeting today in room B311. Remember, volunteering with, with Inspire can, help, can also get your community service hours if you need them, so check it out. The African Student Association, also known as the ASA, would like to invite all students to join them for their regular meetings on Thursdays in A223 from 3.30 to 4.30. Attention all seniors. It is time to vote for a theme for prom. To vote, go to the TC Student Resources page on Canvas and click on Announcements. You must be logged into your school account to vote. Voting will end January 11th at 3.15 p.m. sharp. The theme with the most votes will win. Attention all German club members. You'll be having your annual holiday party tomorrow, Thursday, December 20th, right after school in Harry Levine's room, B101. Are you interested in making a difference? Well, Girls State may be the opportunity for you. It begins June 16th through the 22nd at Longwood University. Applicants must be a rising senior and a citizen, so pass by Mrs. Hahn's room in A119 for an application. It's due January 4th, so don't miss out. The, student, the Superintendent Student Leadership Committee has, meeting has been moved to after winter break, so stay tuned for more information. The French Club will have a meeting in Miss Tomic's trailer room after school today. Check it out. Titans, TC's very own outcasts and sophomore Mia Humphrey are competing to play at the Alexandria First Night Battle of the Local Stars. So remember to vote for them. You can vote for either the outcasts at the link below, or you can vote for Mia Humphrey at the link below. Why not vote for both? <laughs> remember, you can vote once a day on any device. Speaking of First Night Alexandria, the TC Jazz Combo will be performing for First Night Alexandria on Monday, December 31st, from 2 to 4 p.m. at the Hilton Garden Inn near the King Street Metro. As a disclaimer, this is not a battle of the local stars. It's a separate performance. It would be great to see you there. Hey, all you titans out there, TC TV is giving a special award to anyone who brings one of these passes. All you have to do is bring in the pass to A227 and speak with either Miss Zephron or Mr. Lyon. Once you do this, you'll receive a special award from Everyday Titan. It's a win-win for everyone. Another podcast is out with another movie for review. This one's on The Grinch with Jim Carrey, everyone's favorite Christmas movie. Let's check it out. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. You really are a heel. You're as cuddly as a cactus. You're as charming as an eel, Mr. Grinch. All right, let's cut that part out. Um, no, that's going in. Last Thursday, December 6th, the Substance Abuse Prevention Coalition of Alexandria, or SAPCA, held a community meeting to celebrate their 10-year anniversary and plan for the future. Cadence Claypool, Norma Reyes, and myself were there to cover it. Hope you enjoy. Hi, 
my name is Cadence and today we're here at Sapka's community meeting here in the Mini Howard Library. Today we'll be analyzing and looking at some of their events that they've hosted in the past 10 years and celebrating their anniversary and achievements. Everything from legislation to events to posters. So let's go take a look. SAPCA is the Substance Abuse Prevention Coalition of Alexandria. Our goal is to prevent underage substance use and abuse. We do that through a variety of strategies. Part of it is just educating teenagers about the facts of using these substances. We provide a lot of leadership opportunities for youth in, in the city. We actually do a lot of work to support the youth and the Children and Youth Master Plan in the city as we move forward. There's key assets that are positive assets that all youth need in order to be healthy and successful and to make positive choices as, as they move forward in life. And I think that we are on that trend of lowering the um, usage across the board dramatically. A campaign called Parents Who Post Lose the Most, mm -hmm. um, reminding adults about um, that it's legal to, to host a party and give alcohol to minors. To need to seek and then receive care. Sapka's wonderful achievements titans and all the things they've accomplished over these past 10 years. We also got to eat some delicious cupcakes and learn a lot of different ways that we can be drug free. Thanks titans. This has been Cadence Claypool with Liam Harmon and Norma Reyes. Thanks to Norma Reyes, Cadence Claypool and myself for that package. I know I enjoyed it. Well, that's all we have today titans. Hope you enjoyed it and hang in there. Break is only a few days away. As always, my name is Liam Hardman, and you've been watching Everyday Titan. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm.